Just looking at the difference in differences in color of these four rocks. This particular one's hard to see, um, but you can tell in here it's a very um, lemony yellow coloration, not as not as golden as the ones I usually find. It also has a sort of a hint of green in it, um, but a very lemony coloration. Now this one <clears throat> has more of a peach color. Kind of hard to see. On here it's leaning a little bit more green than it is yellow. But um, in different spots it has sort of a peachish color that comes out. Um, but a very nice green you, you might can tell some of that peach up in here, but a very nice green coloration to it as opposed to that yellow. <clears throat> this one's just really nice. I mean, all the way around. Look how, like notice <clears throat> with this one, you get dark spots in there where the light doesn't, it's just a little too dense for the light to spread. <clears throat> also, it's growing in two different directions, so those lines will often sort of halt the light from traveling through. But this one, man, the light just goes through the whole thing. It's beautiful. Um, I imagine if it was cut, it would be, it would probably be pretty nice. But you can see from that coloration that it has a very bright um, yellow coloration to it. It's very golden, like sunlight. Beautiful. I mean, it, it's, it's really a magnificent piece. And then you have this large guy who also, you know, the light goes through it very nicely, but he's got more of a deep, dark yellow in inside. But again, very beautiful. I mean, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. It's just gorgeous. Nice fire. I've been finding them like this here lately. I really like them. Beautiful colors though. Very beautiful colors. <clears throat>